Each year, the James Beard Foundation honors excellence in the culinary industry. You can feel the energy here. It just feels wonderful. The weekend starts with the Media Awards, celebrating the authors and content creators leaving their mark on the food world. This was on my vision board for like five years from now, so. It has been a pleasure to hear all of the stories that people entrust me with. The Leadership Awards follow, spotlighting the complex realms of sustainability, food justice, and public health. Leadership is not a solo flight around the world. In fact, leaders lead with their communities. There are panels and roundtables. We are important, we matter, our, our businesses matter. Networking, and of course, plenty of delicious food from around the country. All of this culminates in the Restaurant and Chef Awards, held at the Lyric Opera House in downtown Chicago. And the winner is, show me the card, Brandon Chow! I'm excited about the evolution of Chinese American food and I'm honored to be representing our version in San Francisco Chinatown. My journey has not been easy, it has not been linear, and it has not been traditional. I stand before you, and I stand here because 10 years ago, I said fear. And today, a little black girl or a little black boy can see themselves as a future outstanding chef. We are back. We're back together. After a two-year hiatus, there has never been a more inclusive, diverse group of nominees, winners, and I think most importantly, a brand new system by which we are recognizing those who are doing great things in American food. And the room has never looked, felt, or tasted as good as it does tonight. Find out what a coveted James Beard Award means for a career and a community. One more stupid and idiot thing, I just want to take a selfie with everybody in behind. It's never happened. As we celebrate those pushing the industry forward. Welcome, everyone, to the James Beard Awards.